Now there is another operator over a language that is called what we call as lean closure. Here, do you people uh, have you people gone through that? Uh, what is clean closure? Generate the words of a language. So, given a regular expression, I can always tell what the language it can generate. Okay. So, suppose my question is. Uh, suppose my question is A plus B. Simple. Let us start simpler. Okay. Then, what does this regular expression means? Can anyone tell me? The language consisting of A, comma B. Okay. Now, suppose I write it as A plus B star. What does this mean? No, no, just uh, uh, tell me in uh, plain English, means I do not want what will be the set of words, it, just in what, what this language means. This language means set of words consisting of either A or B or A and B including null string. Understood? Why this null? Because uh, because I, I have already told you, what is A plus B? It is either A or B. Now, A plus B star means what? So, so this, this represents a language L of A plus B ka star. Okay. Now, L of A plus B is suppose a plus A or B. Okay. Now, 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 if I apply this clean closure operator star, then what it will be? It it is I have already told you it is union of I is equal to zero to infinity, L of A plus B to the power I. Okay. Now this can be what? So first, suppose if you put I is equal to zero, then it is an empty string which is a null string. Okay, i is equal to, you put i is equal to 1, it will be a or b. If you put i is equal to 2, then what it will be? It will be a, 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 b, b, a, b, b. Okay, similarly you can put i is equal to, i is equal to 2, a yeah, i is equal to 3, then it will be a, b, a, all this, all this way, okay. So, it is a set of words consisting of any any length of A and B including the null string. Understood? Okay. Now, suppose uh, let us go to a complicated one. Let us see if you are people. Mm, suppose I write it as A plus B star. A plus B B. What does this mean? So, so looking at a language, you should be able to answer it uh, instantly. Means, means you just need to know the trick. First of all, star means either zero or more than one occurrence of either A or B. This means this way. Okay. What does this mean? This means either I should get A or B B. Okay. Now, this comes at the end. It does not have any closure operator. Okay. 
So I can always say any strings of A and B that end with either A or B B. Understood? Okay. So, so, so in this way, uh, so from from this expression, what uh, so we can infer that there exist some precedence. There exist some precedence of operators in regular expression. What is the precedence? So, so first brackets are anyway means normal mathematical expression the brackets the precedence of the brackets are the highest. So, brackets are the highest. Then, then comes the star operator. Just a second, uh, just give me one minute. Yeah, so then comes the star operator, then comes the union, okay, and then comes the concatenation, and then comes the union plus, okay. So, if I say what will be my A, B, uh, just a second, so uh, let me write A plus B C star, okay. So, what does this mean? Suppose if I write A plus B C star, okay. So, A plus B C star means oh, in, in which way you will interpret the language? Tell me. So, so as I have already told you, first comes the closer star. So, star will be associated with only C, okay. Then comes the concatenation. So, so it will be B C star. That means one or more concatenation of B with one or more C, okay. And then comes the union. So, this represents the strings that either contain A or any string of uh, which, uh, which is concatenation of B with one or more symbols of C, okay. Zero or more symbols of C. Star means zero or more than zero, okay. Understood? Okay. So, now let with this all these uh, things, <coughs> this is the important part of uh, regular expression that is which is known as a theorem which is represented as a theorem. So, it is, it is called, so let me define this theorem. So, if L is a regular language no let me write it uh, this way l is a regular language if and only if so it is represented as double if if and only if there exist a regular expression for it okay so what does this mean this means 